kuhusu BBI. Nataka kuambia mheshimiwa rais Uhuru Kenyatta. It is only a wrong person that can do any other duty when the nation is suffering from corona. BBI suspended in three years ago your goal vision of Agenda 4. Right now, we could not be talking about oxygen, insufficiency of oxygen in hospitals because of universal health care, but because of the confusion that was brought to your office through what is called handshake. Your Agenda 4, which could have become your legacy, is gone with a confused Raila Odinga. So it's that now you are talking of BBI, you want signatures with Raila when people want medicine in hospitals. You are talking today about handshake when the current health situation requires that no more handshake. Things are bad because of Corona. Leave handshake away, leave the satanic reggae away, concentrate on this very one year. It's only one year, my friend. Only one year, President. To do something with only health sector because food security is gone, farmers are crying, tea farmers here receive only eight shillings bonuses, everything is ridiculous. Where would I to be a BPI at the signature? Signature, no one can get us beaten. Jews, the MP, are the only one who can Because of lack of oxygen, our MP, if an MP can die because of lack of oxygen in Mumia's hospital, what about the needy people in the village? They are only under the grace of God. Why do you put to them and then I have signatures? What we are telling you. Wanainji wa mekazirika na yu maneno ya BBI. People are sick, people are dying, you are talking of BBI. People have got no food, you are talking of BBI. And you are ready to waste 14 billion asking people yes or no. This is nonsense. Jamba lingine nataka kusema. Janwa raga zazi wote Kenya hawana school fees. Walifutu wa kazi, wenye walikuwa nafanya kazi maote. Wengi wamefutu wako nyumbani. Watapata wapi pesa ya kulipia karo wanafunsu wa tutu wa. President, the only legacy you can live is to declare free education for one year. Free education. You are talking of collecting signatures when our children are dying of COVID in schools without simple math of 50 shillings. Shame on you, both Raila and Uru. Shame on you. How are you talking about Nigeria? We are talking about the president. We are talking about the deputy president. They don't understand. Principals are dying in schools. Teachers are dying in schools. Our children are becoming COVID every day because of lack of a simple mask. And you are talking about spending 14 billion collecting signatures and going for a random. God forbid you are doing wrong things. And we must tell you, even if you jail me this evening. That is the truth. <laughs>